Today on the Doctor Who Guide, I'm going to show you the top 10 second Doctor DVDs that I would suggest anybody buy. So stick around, because all that and more is coming up. The best box set that you can buy for Doctor Who. Hey guys, welcome back to the Doctor Who Guide, helping you grow your knowledge, your collection, and your connection with other Doctor Who fans. My name is Alex Patterson, and every week I post guide videos, tips and tricks for expanding your collection, skits, and much, much more. And today, thanks to a comment from the Whovian with a small collection who says, I'm stuck on what to buy next with Doctor Who. I think I can help with that question. We're talking about the second Doctor today, and the first DVD on my top 10 list is actually an honorable mention, and that is Doctor Who The Underwater Menace. For a long time there was just one surviving episode from this story. In 2011 the uh, second episode from this story was recovered and it was supposed to get animated but it never did. It was released with a rather shoddy reconstruction. A lot of people don't like it. However, it is the earliest surviving footage we have of Patrick Troughton as a doctor and Fraser Hines as Jamie McCrimmon. So for that reason, I would suggest getting this. Tenth on the list today is Doctor Who The Seeds of Death. This DVD is a special edition. Oftentimes I find that special editions have better bonus features, better covers, and you know, it's a great story of the second Doctor era and it is tenth on my list today. Ninth on my list is a story that is probably one of the first, if not the first, second Doctor stories I watched. Um, and I watched it on Netflix quite a lot, and that is Doctor Who the Mind Robber. Now, um, the story is cool and imaginative, really um, points for originality. It's not necessarily Patrick Houghton's best story as the second Doctor, but I think it's enjoyable nonetheless. And yeah, that is my ninth choice on this list. Next up is my favorite second Doctor and Cybermen story, uh, and that is Doctor Who the Moon Base. Now, a lot of people prefer other Cybermen stories. I have a real soft spot for this story. I just, I absolutely love the setting and the characters and especially the, the design of the Cybermen and the music in this episode is just brilliant. So, the Moon Base, I highly suggest that everybody has this in their collection. The second Doctor and Cybermen is a recipe for success, just like the first Doctor and the Daleks. So, yeah, definitely suggest getting uh, the Doctor Who the Moon Base. Now, if you don't know, there are a lot of Second Doctor episodes that are missing. If you want to know what episodes of Doctor Who are missing, wait, how did they even go missing? Did they ever recover any episodes? How should I collect the surviving footage on DVD? Don't worry, I answer all of those questions in the playlist that I will link up in the card and in the description down below. If you have been following the Missing Episodes saga, or the recovery of the Missing Episodes, then you will know these two stories that are sixth and fifth on our list, Doctor Who, The Web of Fear, and The Enemy of the World. Now, these are two brilliant stories, really great. The acting and stories are brilliant, really atmospheric, and it's just brilliant to see these episodes. All of these stories were recovered, except for one episode of The Web of Fear, which has a photo reconstruction, and it's just brilliant. You've gotta have these stories in your collection. It was great to see them both found at the same time and that they were both great episodes. Comment down below with which ones you like better. Speaking of the missing episodes in their various forms, the fourth DVD on my list today is Doctor Who Power of the Daleks. Now, this DVD has had all six of its episodes animated with the original audio, but comment down below with your experience of this DVD. How did you like the animation of these episodes? It is also the very first episode with a second Doctor, so that is epic. Another must-have DVD for your collection is Doctor Who The Invasion. You can watch my unboxing video, it's quite funny. I was just thrilled to finally have this. And it's rare in America in Region 1, which is America and Canada. And the story's brilliant, it's been referenced in Series 8. It's uh, like the Dalek Invasion of Earth, but it's more like the Cybermen Invasion of Earth. And it's just a brilliant, brilliant story. Some thrilling, iconic scenes, and yeah, I highly suggest getting this again. Episodes 1 and 4 are animated. And, uh, you know, the animation is cartoon, but it's better than nothing. And, yeah, I really uh, enjoyed this uh, DVD and this story. It's really great. It's eight parts, but it does not sag. It is more entertaining than some six-part stories and probably some four-part stories. But, yeah, this is a must-have in your collection and is fourth on my list. I lost count somewhere. So you guys tell me if I'm doing a top 10 or a top 11 video. This is bad. Moving on to my third choice, and that is Doctor Who Tomb of the Cybermen Special Edition. It's very iconic. A lot of people have brilliant memories of this story. As a rule, just don't get too hyped up, but this story really is brilliant. It's for so many people, the best Cybermen story, and that's saying a lot, considering the Cybermen and the Second Doctor are just 
a recipe for success. So yes, definitely get this story. It's brilliant. I'd suggest a special edition. So that is my third choice. Moving on to my top second choice. I love the DVD that is coming up next. I suggested in my top 10 First Doctor episodes, which you should watch as well. Uh, if you want to watch all of the episodes in this series of top 10 DVDs, then definitely check out the playlist that is linked up above and in the description. And that story is Lost in Time, a collection of rare episodes. This collects so many stories. I'd suggest getting the box set because it's probably cheaper than buying this DVD separately, which you can do in Region 1 and Region 2. It's all uh, together on one box set. And this is just brilliant. The second Doctor Lost in Time collection of rare episodes DVD is absolutely a must-have for any Patrick Troughton fan. There are clips, audios, um, full episodes, great bonus features, and it's just really awesome. And in my opinion, really a must have. And finally, we are at my top pick for the best second Doctor DVD that anybody can collect. And that is a DVD that is just outshines all of the others, and that is Doctor Who The Dominators. <laughs> I'm kidding with you guys. Oh, uh, you know, if you like this story, that's great. Uh, a lot of people don't like the story. But anyway, on to the real first choice for this list and that is Doctor Who The War Games. This is really... oh if you thought any of those other stories were good you know Power of the Daleks, The Invasion, the Tomb of the Cybermen, you know, just all of those stories they were good but compared to this massive story it is 10 episodes long four hours and 10 minutes long approximately it is just an incredible story. It's Doctor Who The War Games, and it is just crazy. It's emotional. It's oh, it's so incredible. The scale of it is incredible. Better than the scale of some new series episodes. It is just a brilliant, brilliant episode. I can't tell you how awesome it is. Must, must, must have. And that is my top pick for Doctor Who the second Doctor. So those are my top 10 picks for second Doctor stories, the best second Doctor DVDs that money can buy. I definitely suggest all of these DVDs to anybody looking to expand their DVD collection. And to the Whovian with a small collection, I hope I've helped you grow your collection. And to anybody watching, I hope that uh, this channel and this video has helped you expand your collection. Um, as a side note, The War Games is also a rare DVD, so please don't pay more than 50 bucks for it. Patience is the name of the game when collecting just about anything with Doctor Who, but even more so with Doctor Who DVDs. Don't pay more than $50 for this. It's a brilliant story. Anyway, I want to know, what are your top favorite Patrick Fountain DVDs. Did I miss any? Comment down below. My name is Alex Patterson. This has been the Doctor Who Guide. Definitely subscribe to see more of my videos and I will see you in the next video. Now, this is a DVD that I didn't think deserved needed to be. Doctor Who, The Web of Fear. Doctor Who, The Web of Fear and the enemy of the world.